Good morning students. Today I am going to discuss science and the chapter is adaptation in animals. Animals are found in hot desert, some in very cold places, some in water and some on trees. Like you can see a dog around our home. Fish in aquarium, penguins live in cold region and shark in oceans. So this is adaptation in animals. What is adaptation? The adjustment to suit the conditions of their habitat is called adaptations. Adapting to the environment also helps them also helps them to find food, water and shelter for themselves. So, what is a habitat? A habitat is a place where a plant or an animal lives. It is the natural home of an animals. Animals adjust themselves to the conditions of their habitat for their survival. So, what is a habitat? Let us repeat. It is a place where a plant or an animal lives. It is the natural home of an animals. They have to adjust themselves to the conditions for their survival. Different animals live in different habitat. Now, let us see the uh, adaptation in different animals. Terrestrial animals. Animals that live on land are called terrestrial animals. They have lungs to breathe on air, like lion, tiger, humans, camels, giraffe, etc. A habitat in which the terrestrial animals live are called terrestrial habitat. So it may be desert, it may be plain, polar regions are some of terrestrial habitat. Desert adaptation. Animals such as camels show adaptations that help them live in hot desert. They can go without drinking water for many days. They have broad padded feet. Why? Because they do not sink in the desert sand. So, this is called desert adaptation. Some desert animals, they become inactive during the summer. This is called astivation. So, these desert animals become inactive during the summer month and this is called astivation. Now, polar region adaptation. Animals living in polar regions show adaptations that help them survive there. Animals such as penguins have thick layer of fat that is called a blubber, which is found under their skin. The blubber helps them to keep them warm. The inactivity shown by some of the polar animals during the winter month is called hibernation. So, some animals become inactive during the winter month that is called hibernation. I hope you have understood what is astivation and hibernation. Now, uh, what is aquatic animals? Animals that live in water are called aquatic animals. A habitat in which these animals live are called aquatic habitat like rivers, ponds, lakes, seas and oceans. Aquatic animals, they have fins that help them to swim in water. Turtles have paddles instead of fins, which helps them to swim in water. Now, uh, let, us re uh, let us see the problems that harm these animals. There are many problems which harm these animals. Like first one is, when forests are cleared, many animals lose their habitat. Felling trees creates imbalance in nature also. What is known as cutting of trees or felling of trees? That is deforestation. So it is deforestation is, uh, deforestation creates imbalance in nature and it is a problem for these animals. Therefore, we should not clear forest. Okay, pollution is another problem. Chemical waste from factories are pumped into rivers and oceans. And these aquatic animals get poisoned by this and many die. So, pollution is another problem for these aquatic animals.
Hunting of animals for leather, ivory or spot is also a big concern. It reduces the number of animals across the world. So, people should not do hunting or go for hunting for leather, ivory or sport. Animals, these animals need love and care. You should always be kind towards them. You know some animals are kept as pets at your home. I guess students, you all, you all also have a pet. So it is your duty to feed them properly and keep them clean and take them to a veterinary doctor for vaccinations and treatment. What is a veterinary doctor? That is animal doctors. So you should always love them, feed them and take, uh, take care of them and also take them to veterinary doctors for vaccination and treatment. I hope you have understood this uh, topic that is adaptation in animals. Thank you.